All right. If this is a new episode, welcome. If not, well, let's do this. I swapped up my gear a little bit. Uh, not, not in between episodes, but um, when we got the Great Fairy, I, I managed to upgrade my my depths armor to 12 defense. So I have 12 defense across the board and or 36 defense really. <laughs> Uh, I have a lot. I have so much more health. I should. I I think the days of us being one shot are behind us. And I have some actually really really solid gear. I'm gonna kill these guys first. I want to get to the um the light route that's behind this this. A shrine, for lack of a better term. I think it's on top of this, I want to say. So, if I can ascend through this... Uh, I'll do it right there. There are postals everywhere, but there was an, there were two light routes. I remember seeing that there were two light routes. I think one of them... There it is. There it is. I want to get that. I definitely want to get that. This is also... I don't even know what would have happened had I gone down here first. I, I'm guessing the game probably would have told me um, to go elsewhere, but I don't know. I mean, again, this... It didn't tell me anything when I was in the sky, though every single NPC seemed to want to point me towards that. It's neat that it's not just a boss. Like, I, I didn't expect any of this. I didn't... Oh, I at the top. Oh, it's a, it's a blighted Stelnox. That's, you don't see that every day. I'm having to guzzle down the stuff, which isn't great. It's not great, I'm telling you. Oh, wait, 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 I landed on something. You know, I pr probably should just be doing uh, one of these. There. That was pretty lucky, though. Okay, let's get a let's get a better look. Honest, not gonna lie. When I when I saw that Stalnox, I thought that it was Ganon, like legit Ganon. It looked like his uh, his pod of resurrection, to be honest. Although you know, I, it might not be possible for us to have gotten down here, because remember, it was opened for us. It this might be a closed region. Uh, where did the Stelnox even go? He's right there. I'm gonna go kill that Stelnox. Because I should be able to just drop right down and and get to, uh, one of the limbs. Yeah, this... The music is unique. That's the thing that's getting me. Like, this is so huge, apparently. And it'll be interesting because as I go through, like... This is one of the biggest recording sessions in the Let's Play. And I know that the the comments are going to be full of of people saying, "Pal, you should go down there. You should go down there. It's it's going to be awesome. You'll love it." And, you know, I I'll have I'll have had none of that. Okay, let's run so he doesn't sit on me. Oh, good job. Good job. Um, you're, you're gonna have to go through me, buddy. I, kn I I'm aware that your your friend is behind you, but um, I don't much care. I don't. I don't much care. Which drops the loot? I assume this drops the loot. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. It's coming down to me anyway. Whee! Ooh, I love giant... I love me some giant boomerangs. But uh, do I even have a space for it? That's a 43 power weapon. That's not too good. We're getting some actually amazing gear right now. Royal... We're kitted out. We're really kitted out right now. 
And I'm excited to use the giant boomerang that I have now. I like boomerangs in this game. Boomerangs, I don't get to use them a whole lot, but they're really fun. Uh, especially with a lot of the stuff you can merge onto them or fuse onto them. Uh, you can make them, I mean, you're going to see. There, There is a goblin, uh, goblin, a bokoblin encampment um, to, to my left, like down there. Um, and I'm I'm definitely going to be using this new boomerang on it because I put a uh, I put a gleok a thunder gleok horn on it, so it just becomes like like Thor Stormbreaker, right arm depot. Just drop down to the home. Are these? Wait, these are. This is a dungeon. This is a dungeon. This is a legit dungeon. Thank you, Zelda. This is like the Champion's Ballad Dungeon. Oh, wait. Oh, we get to have to have it printed. This is like a schematic? What? 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 Wait, why is there a wheel? Why is there a wheel? I don't get it. These are all wheels. This is, this is actually Really cool. This is uh, above and beyond what I thought that they were capable of or going to do. Like when this, when I talk about when I've talked about the perfect Zelda game and what I want from it, this checks a lot of the boxes. This is a dungeon, a non-essential entire dungeon. Uh, what is this? This bar can't be interacted with. Right? I'm not- I'm obviously not gonna touch it. It looks like this is broken, and while I could possibly cheese it across, I guess I do need to. Why is this here? Do I need to connect power to something? It's- it's incredibly derelict. So it just looks like I need to figure out a solution to get this across. And I think I might have one. Um, if I can take this wheel and place one there, it should be headed that way, right? I guess the price of failure is it just goes towards me. Okay, maybe that, that's probably not going to work. I'm going to try it because I can always recall the thing. But maybe that's not what I want. I think I'm being thrown for a loop with whatever this is trying to do. I'm gonna... I hate to do this, but this is also a big, a big undertaking. I'm... I'm using Recall Ultra Hand on this. Okay, I know this isn't how I was supposed to do it. I'm not honestly sure how I was supposed to do it, but I did it. I have it through, and it looks like it was supposed to follow that path, which I don't think much matters anymore. What's in what's in this little room? Spare parts and uh, <laughs> are they really? I'm down. I'm so down. I'm so down. We're gonna get to ride this thing. That's sweet. I'm gonna turn it into a car. Is it perfect? No. Is it kind of fine? Yeah, it's... I wonder if it would work as a bike, actually. Perfect. Not perfect. Fine. Fine. If I have to defeat all you schmucks, then I will. Watch this. Get Stormbreakered, and then... I forgot I had that. Where's my rod? Where's the rod? There it is. Stormbreakered. 
so much death. I don't know where my boomerang went, but it's fine. I don't know where my thing went, but that's fine. Whoa, that's... You have a wind blade? Good shot. I don't like where you're at. You know what? Let's get him to better ground. This should kill him. Ow. Good job. There. Dropped a wind blade. That's decent. Now to find my weapons. Buddy, you're gonna die in two hits. Why even try? Here's my concern, though. Was I supposed to, like, smelt this and bring it? Or is it okay in the box? It's okay in the box. One down. Three to go. Technically two down. Three to go. Technically. That's one. Bring the other three here as well. Her voice is oddly... Not mystical. It's it's somewhat mundane. Which makes me wonder just the, what nature of person this is. There's no echo attached to it. She's very matter of fact. There isn't a whole lot of personality that's bleeding through, unless that is the personality. That she's just even keel, calm, and objective focused. So that that first, uh, the, the arm was a little bit of a miss. Because I don't know what I was supposed to do to get through that puzzle. That giant lightning rod was very strange to me. It almost sounds like each region is it has its own music as well. Oh, yeah, of course. We got first step. First step, we always got to get the actual limb. Got it in its wrapper. All right. Rockets built in. That's fun. Should have fused that. Fine. Actually, probably best that I didn't. Uh, I'm down playing around with rockets. Looks like I'm supposed to inject it into that. There's enough room for me to put rockets on all sides. Uh, ah, that adjusts the angle. And I get to ride it as well. That's sick. Make sure it's not attached to the other rocket, because that, that could be awkward. Alright, take me take me away. Perfect shot. And I kept the rockets? That's always rare when that happens. Oh, yeah. This is perfect. This is totally fine. This, is gonna, this one's gonna be easy. I get more rockets? Why? Oh. Was that in the other one as well? Are there chests in each? What is that? We get more bombs. I don't know why there's a rocket platform down there. We don't need it. And actually, why am I not taking this Zonite as well? That's free Zonite, and I might actually need this. This is totally fine. This is also gonna be much quicker than the other one. No enemies in the way. Not a whole lot of rocket juice left, but just enough. Come on. Ah, oh, barely not enough, but still. I call that a success. As it explodes everywhere. That is a, come on. Left leg down? Did I have it upside down? Yeah, I did. Left leg down! The enemies are, have severely dwindled. Never, I spoke too soon. So it looks like each and every region, each and every leg of this journey, or arm, I don't discriminate, uh, brings its own different enemies. 
But we have yet to find enemies inside the the trial itself. There's a slight unnerving chorus that comes through every now and then just sneaks through. It's sad, but it's child childlike, I guess. Pure. Okay. What are we doing in this one? Whoa. Okay. What does this do? Wow, that's... Whoa. Oh, no. I don't have gear for that. Okay. Gotta make this quick. Don't start on fire. Don't start on fire. Don't start on fire. I think I'm okay? I'm okay. Okay. This is not true lava. It looks like I'm gonna be asked to float through it. But what am I... Am I taking the wheels with me? If I do, I seal myself in, at least for the time being. I think that's what I'm doing. Now right, let's go. That's a treasure if I've ever seen one. I'm also kind of surprised I made that jump. Or is it? No, it definitely is. So each of these is going to have something optional in it. I'm still kind of scratching my head literally on what the first room had. Okay. We are going to need those. I'm honestly flabbergasted at what the reward for this this trial could possibly be. Do we get... Do we get a construct? Do we get like a, a mecha friend? Oh, whoops. I want to take the extra wheel with me. But I didn't really think about how it might get in the way twice. Okay, we have our wheels. I don't remember exactly how this went. Is it like this? How, how did that go? Fused it, and then I hit it. No. There, okay. And I still have two tires, and that's that's really good. That's gonna help me. Oh well, first and foremost, there's a chest. And then I I heard a sound like a shrine activated. Although it must be, I think it's just through the other side. Yeah, it's just the other side to spawn another another thing. I'm not missing anything. No, nope, that's where I started. No chest to be had. I don't know what these are supposed to be doing. They might just be decor in a fancy, schmancy way of giving us fans. Oh, that is exactly what it is. That's it. Yeah, that's exactly what's happening. Uh, yeah, I can... I'll take fans. I don't know what's still draining my battery, but it's kind of annoying. Hopefully, as I get away from this, it deactivates, because it's... Like I said, it's not ideal. Turn, hard turn, hard turn, or not. Sure, that worked. That worked perfectly well. Uh. Um, where's this taking me? Do I want this to go all the way? It's also, how often do we have, like, an actual water current under or in the depths? It's almost never. Uh, fine, fine, fine. They didn't want me to have the wheels at this point. I made it a little bit more awkward than I had to, but it's it's working. I'm completing it. I'm completing it. We're almost done. And I do this with bated breath. For what the reward could be. It's cool that they actually put a light there, uh, in, of all things. Like... It's just neat how much they use the game's mechanics, and they don't feel tacked on. They feel very true. In Breath of the Wild, Cryonis largely felt tacked on. It didn't feel very important. Um, like, obviously it was needed sometimes. One more left, Link. 
The body for my spirit is nearly complete. And I'm excited. 